Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Crispy TV and today we're doing another challenge. I'm joined with my brother, the Diamond Melon, and we're going to be doing a wall challenge. I don't know what we're going to call it yet, let's call it a wall challenge. Let's just say that, a wall challenge. We haven't done a challenge in like a month, I'll say, and them sheep are annoying. I haven't done a wall. I, I looked in the comments and I saw, well, why wouldn't you do a wall challenge? And this was months and months ago when I did the last one. So I thought, instead of doing Night to the Moon, why don't me and my brother? Me and my brother, that was weird, have like a challenge to collect. It's to get all the sheep died in every single wall. The 16 wall altogether. The like cocoa wall, which is about brain wall. You got like the yellow, obviously. They're the easy ones. But instead of keep me talking and talking about it, I'm going to actually start. Well, well, now, obviously. Instead of keep talking about it. But you can see we've got every single 16. The 16 sheep here, hopefully. If I can count correctly. And then you've got the beacon. So if you win and you got every single one and you think you got every single one, you press it. It changes to your colour, which mine is grey and Nathan should be blue. Yep. So then that's how we work. So Nathan, you ready? Oh, before I start, I need to get my stuff first. Look, all my stuff is in here. We've got like basic stone weapons, torches, and food, just so you can actually don't actually keep running around to have to kill everything to get your food and actually to gather all these weapons. Obviously, you probably have to go mining. Even if you see like a sheep, I'd say to find a sheep, you have to go mining to actually get the specific shears. What am I saying specific shears? That's, I'm just babbling on. I need to put it in night so we can sleep. I can see Nathan in the window. <laughs> Who is that spider in the window? And I thought I turned it to night. But we're on, the thing is, we'll be on easy. So they'll have mobs and everything after when it turns night. So you want to gather the stuff then come back. Oh, actually, no, I can't come back home. We need to go ready. The plan I'm going to do is get this yellow wool quickly. Not yellow wool, but these yellow flowers. And because there's cactuses wherever we are, around we are. So get these yellow cactuses and hopefully get enough so Nathan can't use his. But the twist with this is, is that if you actually, not losing, but you can actually have one chance that you can actually dye one of their, their sheep, any colour, so they can get the, like, the hardest one, which is probably magenta, which is like four colours, and you can just change it. So then you can actually, just, you know what I mean? You can just change it so they have to go out and collect it again. So what I'm going to do is quickly get one of these cactuses, because that's what I want. What's Nathan getting? I'm trying to see what he's getting. He just destroyed something. But I don't know what he got. I don't know. I'm just going to get his cactuses because that's another one. What I might do, I might make the actual wall and stick it in the other chest because I've got two chests. So I'm going to stick all my wall that I've got in the chests. And then with that, I can actually see what wall I've got, which wall I haven't. I might actually bring my crafting table with me so I can actually just go around quickly. Like the wall is here, look. There's my yellow wall. I need to just make all this yellow, all this red. I need the orange. I've got orange, that's done. Because I'm going to do it right at the last minute, because I'm not going to die, because then Nathan can change it, can't I? Wait, what, I, can't, I need to furnace this, don't I? And I've got no coal, so I have to go mining for coal. But you can see, here's some more wool. Like, I'm going to stick it all here. Put that there. Put my green one there, that's what I need to furnace that. So we've got them. Let's see what wool we need. And let's see what materials we need. Like, this should be pretty quick challenge. We need lapis, so we have to go underground. Loads of lapis. Oh, it's going to be annoying, isn't it? So we need loads of lapis, we need pink, which is magenta, which is purple, we need purple and pink, and pink is, is that pink? No, magenta, magenta dye, oh, there's loads of different magenta dyes, you can just do different ones. Purple and pink, lapis and rose red, bone meal, bone meal, we need to fill skeleton, five skeletons, so I'm going to go underground in a bit. That's realistically all we need, or we need an ink sack, which is a squid, grey dye, which is... An ink sack, and uh, so we have to get loads. Of, so this is going to be pretty annoying. Like I think I've got enough cactuses, so that's done. And never can't go in my rooms. So he can't come in my room and take everything. So that's like one of the rules. I can't go in his room and check his stuff. So what I'm going to quickly do instead of getting that crafting table. He's break some wood. I can hear zombies. Did you hear that zombie underground? <laughs> I need to go get some wool. I mean, get some wood and then go underground quickly. Get some lapis was I need. So that's pretty low down, and then come back up and actually get. So I need to make a crafting table first, that's the, that's the obvious one thing, so I can actually bring one underground, so I can actually do it. And I get a furnace, and I've got food, so I need to eat quickly, actually. So that's what we need to do. I might go the ink sack last, because I think that'd be the easiest one, like getting the squids. They're pretty easy, they can spawn in deep water. So that'd be easy, but it's the skeletons that are annoying. Like, I could just go around in the day, get the squid, get everything else, and then go underground. Actually, I might go underground till it comes day. I mean, night time. And then when it comes night time, I'm just going to... Make that into wood. Make a crafting table. That's all we need, really need this wood for. 
realistically. I'm going to go underground now, try and find a good mine, and then hopefully that mine can lead us straight down. We don't want a rubbish mine, you need a good mine that goes straight down underground. Like they're, they're really rare to find, because normally you have to dig down yourself. But really, you want a mine that you can just go straight down, straight back up. Like one of these challenges, somebody else did do it, like a, a bigger YouTuber, like a way bigger. Like, I think it was Stamping Squid, but theirs was ages ago. But my job, the reason I wasn't going to do this challenge was because of that. But then I looked at my comments and someone put that, and I was like, you know what? I'm actually going to do that challenge, because I think it would be pretty fun. It's a pretty easy challenge, because normally you can have PvP challenges. Which I might start doing the challenges more, if you guys want to see them. Like, like leave a comment below, or even a like, because a like will be able to tell me. If you like it, then that means other people like it. So that means I could do more of them. I know you want more of them, that's what I mean. But yeah, you can just leave a comment, and like your challenge ideas as well, and I'll probably do some more. I'll probably alternate between this and Night to the Moon, and then on Sunday I might not alternate between Pixelmon and actual and actual uh, quick builds. Because I don't know, I think you like quick builds, because my highest video I've got, my popular one, is actually a pixel art, and I've got cramp, <laughs> like in real life, I've got cramp. That's not good. Playing, f playing this while I've got cramp is annoying. I don't want cramp, I'm, all I'm doing is sitting here. So what we need to do this is get... Make this lighter for you guys, obviously. Is get this coal. So I need quite a lot of coal to actually furnish stuff. The thing is, with these challenges, I'm always thinking, oh, nothing's ahead of me. Oh, nothing's going to do this. Oh, nothing's way further than me. So I actually always get a bit. I don't know. I get a bit nervous. What I've got to do is I've got to take my time this time. Imagine if you had to, like. This is the worst mine ever. It leads me to the other side. Oh, 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 oh. You beauty. This guy just proved me wrong. Not this guy. This thing's proved me wrong. So our objective is to get some iron. Which we need to mine some cobblestone. And then with that cobblestone we can get a furnace obviously. And then get the lapis. No, to make the iron. To get the iron pickaxe to get the lapis. Because you can't do it with a lot of stone tools. So we had to go mining either way in this. I was thinking, let's make a challenge with it actually go mining. Then I realised, you have to go mining. To get the lapis. Well, that was after the, in the video, obviously. Right now, I need to do. You need to get lapis <laughs> because I, I, all I did was made the houses look uncreative. Like, oh, there's 14 more iron. Beauty, beautiful, beautiful. I try to make it light for you guys. There's actually like I think they should actually do this Mojang or whatever's doing it is to make it. If you hold a torch, it actually makes everything else lighter instead of it is now where you have to place it down because this is annoying. Ooh. Is lapis spawn high? Does it spawn low? I'm actually confused. I might actually, oh, I can't kill, should I put, mm, I don't know if PvP is enabled, so I can't kill Nathan, no, because he's, he's keeping ventures, I couldn't kill him anyway, I'm just saying if he's really far and boy me, I could kill him and then he makes him spawn way back, but I think that'd be a bit unfair, so let's make, put this crafting table quickly, let's make an iron pickaxe just so he doesn't waste any time going around, so put this down, put this in there, and then we should, should we just walk around a bit and then check what we can find? Skeleton. Oh, bone meal. Bone meal. Come here, you beauty. Here, beautiful. Here, beautiful. You're looking a bit, um, bare today. Looks like... I can see your skin and bones. <gasps> That's not what I need. <laughs> That's not... Oh. Imagine diamonds in this situation, though. I wouldn't need them. Because this is not enough to do with PvP in us. If that was lapis, I'll be... I'll just be ecstatic. All it really is, this, is look. Look, you can have the look of the draw and get lapis straight away. I want to win this challenge, because the last challenge with Drew... Which is 1-1. One, one. Realistically, Nathan should have won. Let's be honest. Because he gave me the actual... The actual thing of a bob. The actual anvil. Or was it the anvil? Compass? He gave me the compass. Or something like that. Yep, we can make this pickaxe. Let's just take this back home. We don't need any more. I don't need to take this back. Make this iron... Iron sword? No. Iron pickaxe. These sticks. And there's a, I thought I heard a creeper then just blow up. I thought I heard a creeper just go... You know when they do that little... That noise... Well, they actually ex look like they're going to explode. Leave that torch there. Get the pickaxe. Keep this pickaxe on. But put this back. Put that one in there. Keep that iron in there. Wall. Oh, we need that. So this, all we need to do is not go look after iron. We don't need armor. It could be help us a bit. The armor could. But really, we don't need it. <gasps> Beautiful. Beautiful. I think we've got to keep inventory on. Yeah, we have. So I can literally just jump down. Get that. And then get out of there. And I'm done. I'm literally done. I think we need quite a lot of... Oh! I think we need quite a lot of lapis. But I'm done with this. And that, that's one of the big ones. One of the big daddies. We've got them. Is this perfect 12 of these bad boys? Oh! <laughs> I'm happy. That was literally look. Look at the draw. That's all this really is. You want the look and you saw it. And I've got it. I've got one of the big bad boys that we need. And that was this. Like, we could explore a bit more and wait till day. 
But I haven't got like a clock or anything, so I don't know if it's day or not. Place this down. I don't think we need cobblestone, put that on there. I might look in and go around and look for some more skelly bobs. Because, oh, gold as well. Do we need gold? Do we need gold? I don't actually know if we need gold. No, you don't need gold for any anything. There's more... Oh, skelly bob up there. Uh, two emeralds. I, I thought emeralds are rare in the diamonds. Yet I found two... Two finger me bobs. Oh, literally, don't ping me about. That's not what I'm about. I'm not about... Oh, two skeletons. You couldn't think of a bit. I'm getting lucky here. I think I might actually win. I'm not going to get too... My ego get over me though because I don't want to get too much of an ego and be like, oh, I'm definitely gonna win this now. Look how many bones I got. I'm a, I need a few more bones. Actually, no, should I go back up and then go? Imagine we found a skeleton spawner, that. that'd be brilliant. And then ravine, we found a ravine. This is awesome. It's actually pretty awesome. I've got, I've got really lucky here. I'm mean, actually, actually, boy, happy. I was about to say that, but then I stopped myself. I think we should get at this water. Why am I drifting? I might look around one more, see if I can find one more skeleton. So we can actually just get what, a bit more bone meal, because I don't think this would be enough, because I think there's a lot of need that need lo need up. I can't even speak. I'm just, I don't know, I'm going to kill myself, forget it. Imagine if I haven't put complete keep inventory on it and I've just lost all my stuff. Nope, I haven't. It's still day. I might go to that water, I know there's water outside our place, and look for a, an ink sack. We need quite a, a few, so I'm going to have to kill a few squids. And I hate killing squids, because they're the most harmless... Po Pokemon, say Pokemon, the most harmless thing about mobs, mobs, they're the most harmless mobs out of everything, so you can literally just go up to them, kill them, and it's turned night, which is actually a good and slash bad thing, like if we go back to bed, then we get rid of them, it's a witch cove place, They've, oh looks like he's got lapis as well, oh no, oh no, no, I need squids, I need squids, I need squids, I think is I can't see squids underground, where would squids spawn? I don't know if it's spawning deep water, but is deep, this deep enough? Yeah, it's deep enough. I'm sure it's deep enough. He's got lapis, that's why he's come home. And I, I think he's, I don't know if he's got skeletons or not. I need a squid. Just make all my wool at the moment. No, I don't want to make all my wool. But I'm going to go over to my house and make this all into wool. Actually, lapis you don't need to change into actual wool. But, oh, he's got a black one. He's changed it into black. Ooh, I've got this. I've got this. Just don't you worry, guys. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. I've got this. So we need to put this into that. So that's all we will need. We've got a furnace now, so we can put that into our furnace. Put the coal, put that. So that will, will melt off. So then we need... Is lapis, you just change it to lapis straight away? Oh yeah, you just need a, lap, a block and you change it to lapis. That's a die. So do we need any more blues? We need some of these. So 12 is enough. I think that'd be enough for everything. We've got the blue, we've got the green. We've got... We've got the green, we need the black. We need the grey, which is just black and white, so that's enough. Black, white and white for light grey, so we've got that one. We've got blue and grey, white, so that's light. We've got that. We've got that. We haven't got that, which is, hey, do you make pink? Hey, do you make pink dye? Is pink just thinking in white, is it? Yeah, we've got that. We've got every single one. I literally think we've got every single one apart from the dye. So I need to quickly just do something. I'll have one of these. I need to get some ink sacks and I think I'm literally done. Whoa, well, commission happens done. Need one ink sack and that's it. That's all I need is one ink sack. And you, you see that? You see that? That was perfect tactics. I needed to do that. Like I needed to actually find... Where's the... Where's squid when you need them? Like they never spawn when you need them. Why is it whenever you do like these type of challenges or these type of things, you need a squid and they go disappearing. They're like, nope, you're not good at me. How did Nathan find a squid? I can't even find one. Like, I'm going to do mine all in one go. So then, oh, there's a witch in there. Is that a witch? Do witches have ink sacks? No, I mean, not like af actually have ink sacks. I mean, did they hold ink sacks? We should have made a boat. Because then I could be... Oh, should I make a boat? I've got my crafting table with me. I don't think I need it anymore, my crafting table. Should I make a boat so I can actually just quickly see them? Okay, how far did Nathan go to find his ink sack then? Look, like, I don't know. Oh, man, this is annoying. I've got a bow. <laughs> but that would be perfect if this is a PvP challenge. But it's not. Transportation. Boat. Need more wood. Make a boat. All I need that, and then this is done. I could win this. I think this is coming down to the wire. Look, like, I've got everything, apart from the ink sack. Get that, and I'm sorted. Please, can I just have a squid? That's all I want. 
If I lose this because I can't find anything set, this is so stupid. Like, Nathan, I think Nathan could win this and I could have done none. But all I need is an ink sack. That's all I need. Can you please just give me the... Oh, oh I'll just break it open. It's perfect. Oh, squid, can you just spawn? I just want to... Oh, where's the squids? <laughs> is any down there? Can, it, can you guys see any squids? I can't see any squids whatsoever. I think I'm going to lose this because I've got no squid. Wow. This is stupid. I think I've lost it because I've got no squid. Because Nathan had the ink sacks and he had everything. And I can't find one squid. That's all I need to win this. One squid. Why can't I find a squid? Look, if he's found that bow mill, he's won. Because that's all you need, is the bow mill. The, the basically bulbs are probably the worst. Really, no ink people. Really? This is stupid. Look, if you found an ink person over here, a squid over here, this would be stupid. I can't find any. How rare are these squids? <laughs> I thought they normally spawn, like, quite rare, easily. Oh, I can't find one. This is annoying. Really, really annoying. Like, I'm just going to go back and do my things. Because that's all I can do here. Because I'm just going to have to go out back again. And find a squid. What's he doing? Where's he going? <laughs> So how much has he got? He's got a black, he's got every single one, a white one. Has he got every single one? No, he hasn't got one. He hasn't got every, he's got every single one apart from one. That's all he's got. <laughs> every single one apart from one. So I'm actually gonna, I'm actually I'm gonna keep looking for ink sacks. I can't do anything apart from looking for an ink sack. I need that one ink sack and I could win. That's all I need. Can you spawn ink sack? That's all I ever wanted. That's all I need is an ink sack. Should I just go back and do all my stuff and come back and get an ink sack? Because ink sacks are not. How do you find. Is there any squids that drop them or can you get in, in villages? Do you think you could get them in villages? Or do you think they only spawn like, like this? Nope. PvP. PvP. <laughs> I need, did I get shot loads of times? Where's Nathan going? Hasn't he won? Hasn't he got an ink sack? Or just trying to stop me from getting one. We just have to quickly go over there and see what we can find. Like I can't find any squids. Oh, there's one over there. Now if you don't kill this, you've got a black you got a black one already. No, don't kill it. That'd be cheating. That's just cheating. What did he kill him for? He's already got one. I don't care if you got a diamond sword. That's so stupid. He's already got one and he's he just killed it. I need an ink sack. That's just stupid. So that's the that one we found, and he kills it. What a plank. Why did he have to kill it? Because he already got like all the black. He's got every single thing. Oh, there's brain wool, there's cocoa beans, and I've got no cocoa beans. Okay, this challenge just went from bad to worse. I think Nathan might have won this now. Yep, he's won it. He's got every single one. Oh, because he killed that ink sack guy. What did he make him for? Because he, he had already had got the black. You only need the black for finger, unless you need it for the grey. Well, can you see anybody see any one here? I'm going to finish it anyway. That's one thing I want to do. I'm going to finish it. So I want to do everything. But I need this ink sack boy to come. This ink sack, what's his face? I don't know his name. We need a squid. Why can we have a <laughs> I'd just say, why can't we have ballistic squids come and just like, let's kill him and just get Robbie's ink sack? That's a bit nasty, isn't it? He's still a squid. Really? Look, creeper, stop being a squid. You're not a squid. You always drop his gunpowder. You don't drop anything else. So don't be silly. So all we need is one little ink sack. Look, there's one that spawned there, but he's not spawning. I need to tra traverse, traverse everywhere and find this squid. Yeah, just blast me. Could have blast me over there. That's all I want you to do. This is a bit annoying now because I've done the most enjoyable part, which was the actual going round. But all I need was one ink sack. Oh, was it more? No, it's multiple. I need multiple ink sacks. Not one. You know what? I'm just going to go back and do as much as I can. And come back after. And you know, you see what I mean? When you want a squid, they don't spawn. When somebody else you're playing with wants a squid, they get it straight away. And then they kill it. When you want that squid. So uh, instead of just keep traversing across the floor, I'm just going to go and find, just do the rest that I need to do. Hopefully get a cocoa bean, they're not hard to find. And Nathan's won. 
That's so stupid. I didn't do any what I've done one. That's the white one. I haven't done nothing else. Because now a stupid squid won't spawn. Okay, come you get to find two squids. I couldn't even find one. He finds two squids. I will kind of find one. Yeah, he's found two. That's so stupid, that is. So stupid. Nathan's the winner of this challenge. I thought I would have won, but he killed that stupid ink squid guy. So annoying, you all. So annoying. But he won the challenge. I hope you enjoyed it. It was annoying for me because I couldn't find a stupid squid. It was, I would have won. Look how close it was. It's actually pretty long. I don't know if I'm going to keep this in one video if it's not too big. Or if you want to go, I'll probably split it, maybe. Part one and part two. I don't know. It depends. But thank you guys for watching. And I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you, if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you guys are brand new. And.